Hey guys, this is Matt. Just want to reach out to you. And what ended up happening was I had to actually reinstall the Live Wires and the Pi game for Chapter 11 on my new hard drive. While I was attempting to do that, I kept getting this specific error saying that no module named Pi game was actually occurring. Very frustrating, so I finally figured out why. When we initially started the book we actually installed Python 3.4 now among the folders that was provided to us it has Python 3.1 you're actually going to have to go in and reinstall this particular 3.1.1 once you do that you will actually be installing it and it will go into most likely a C drive Python 31 this particular folder and that's okay. So go ahead and install this into that Python 31. Once that occurs, then you're going to have to go in and install Pygame. Now, this notice this Pygame is specifically for Python 3.1. So once you double click it and hit run, I'm going to install it just for me, it will ask you specifically which folder to put this in. Go ahead and click on this and will be installed on local hard drive or even the entire feature. But notice here is what I'm looking for. Provide an alternate path on, excuse me, provide an alternate Python location. This particular location is the same one that the Python 3.1 was installed on. So again, if I go back and I do Python 31. I'm going to have to change this default to Python 31 folder. Hit next and install it. This will take a couple of minutes to actually install depending on how fast the processor speed is on your particular machine. Once it's finished, click on finish. Step number three, live wires then we can go in and hit our setup bat for live wires we'll go ahead and run that we see here that it actually run pretty quick hit enter continue to get out of there now we're done with that now once all that is done we have successfully I hope installed Pygame and live wires onto our older version of Python 3.1.1 once that occurs, then we can go into our particular big score PI. Always use the bat file. We're going to click on the bat and it should run. And then we should actually see what we're looking for on this particular Pi game or chapter 11. Sorry for the confusion, guys, and everything, but I understand the frustration as I just went through it and hope this actually helps you guys get this started.